sure. Let me check. Yeah, right's the wrong one. Left one's the right one here. So that's... Uh, what? It's... It's right then. Never mind. No, it's just middle. There we go. So there we go. Now you understand where I am. Now you can kind of get that's. So there we go. Now we know where. Now we know where I am. Anyway. Hey guys, we're back. So like I said, right after that battle I was just in that the last video ended with, and we're gonna run to a little dead end with a bunch of doors. And what? There's someone in this room. That's the little camera angle I was talking about. So nowhere in this place do you see an enemy, but in the future you're gonna walk into a room that has enemies. And this is Send Time. This is the guy that Hans was talking about when we got the moonstone from him. This guy can do stuff. He can open see so that's an elevator. That DOS elevator. Anyway. So he's gonna open he's gonna allow us to use it now. And because he allows us to use these, we can use these to get into more places around this place. Yeah. Yay! Confusing. He's gonna help us get around the mine more with these elevators. So that's gonna help. So, yeah, that was the only thing there, so don't worry about it. Just click on the side of this thing. Vice walks in on his own. And the elevator's gonna take you up. And here we are. I'm in a new area of this place. And you're gonna get right up here to find a door. Nope, nothing in here. Just Azal Seed. Leave this raises vigor? Yeah. I'm gonna give that to Aiko. I don't care I don't care much for the seeds, so I got hiccups. I don't care much for what most seeds do. I usually just Yeah, that's So that's where that place back in the beginning, that's where it takes you. It takes you here. I know what you're thinking. Essentially why don't you just come this way first? Because it leads to an elevator that's gonna be locked, so it's gonna waste a bunch of time. Yeah, I'm skipping through most battles. Because we've pretty much seen everything. There's a couple other, enemy, other enemies you haven't seen yet, but we'll see those guys eventually. Another three inch blaster, because we can always use another one apparently. Uh, Might as well. Then we're going to equip this B type cannon, because it does more damage, it has a better chance of hitting, and it has a better SP. Yeah. Yep, okay. I like how this game shows you how like big it could be, because it shows you like all the different things and it kind of explains to you how big the world is. But it's not like you ever get to be in an empty room. Okay, never explains to you things like why a certain area is so big and stuff and things like that, so I don't know. Like, for example, that B-type cannon says, uh, like, based off the G-type cannon, it's kind of like, well, we can't get the G-type cannon, what's the point? God damn these battles. You like you have no idea. These are actually taking me a little while each of these battles. Anyway. So we got Noxus and our first attorney outside of Fina's, I believe. We need some healing being done. Everyone's okay now. Let's just do this again. And we're gonna come out here to have the loco drill. Now usually any sort of weapon like that. He's gonna be equipped to Drachma, which I haven't done yet. Equip it sooner or later. Ah, there we go. I equipped it to him in that battle. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. Interrupted me twice. And right after the other. It's pretty mean. Anyway. Um then we go this way I guess. Oh this is a new area. I forgot. Oh okay. That area lands you on that platform down there. 
And where's this one? This one just heads straight. I'm not watching these battles. I'm missing out on a few enemies because of that, but really, I don't care. I don't really like this place that much. It's just annoying, and... Oh. My. God. Another one. It's the second time to come up in a row like that. Sounds like it's telling me don't keep skipping them. There we go, found it. That's what we were looking for. Anyway. This one's going to take us down. And I'm pretty sure we're almost near the end of this place. Yeah, here we go. We saw this little road earlier. Pretty sure there's a cham on that, if you can get over there. But I forget how to get there, so... Uh, <laughs> Okay, let's just keep going. Anyway. Cutscene. We're approaching the end of this video too now, so... Luckily, it's right before a boss battle sort of idea, so... I know there's a couple of guards standing there because the moment you walk into this room, they're going to attack you, so you got to be careful. So walk in, door close, door close, battle! Well, we're approaching the end of this video anyway, so eh, we still got a little, we got a couple minutes here, so we're just going to get to this battle as far as we can and then we'll end it off when the video would end as we should these guys are very weak too we might be able to beat them before this video is over You know that moved pretty well from back in the red place. So anyway, we're about down to our last few seconds here, about 20 seconds. Let's see if we can kill them right before the end of this place. And, yep, okay. So, we'll see you guys all later. Peace. Yeah, here we are. We're going to check the first door. First door we got four glyphs of might, which are good because it kind of shows you why we're going to need them. Well, we're going to need them in the near future. I believe this one has what we came here for. Yep, here he is. Here's Asapa. Ooh, what a horn dog. Anyway. 